Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Um, hi everybody, um, I hope you've um, had a, as good weekend as uh, possible and I hope you enjoyed the footage video of Colville Marble Square, a brand new one yesterday. Um, if you're new here to my channel, my, na uh, my name's Rebecca. Um, and I love talking about travel and lifestyle. So uh, please subscribe. I upload five times a week on both my travel and my lifestyle channel. Uh, so today I'm going to be doing um, a, a vlog on travel news, uh, latest 10 exciting facts worldwide, September 2022, part five. This is according to breakingtravelnews.com. And uh, thank you for, um, if you do uh, share, thumbs up, uh, subscribe, um, or um, decide to um, um, basically uh, purchase a membership uh, from me a big thank you for, uh, for that and um, so i'm going to jump right into uh, number one qatar airways um, and british airways have completed the latest uh, phrase in their partnership wow that sounds exciting qatar airways and british airways have completed the latest it, facing their expansion of their partnership offering global connectivity between more countries uh, than any other airline joint business so well done to both Qatar Airways and British Airways for that um number two World Tourism Day uh, celebrates um to put spotlight on Oman's diverse offerings. Wow, Muscat, the, ca the capital of um, Oman, the sul uh, Sultan, uh, represented by the Ministry of Heritage and Tourism, will mark um, uh, today, uh, Tuesday, the World Tourism Day by organising um, special events and activities aimed at en enchanting the, the status of Oman and um, the Arab country in the Middle East as um, a distinct tourist destination so I hope that goes as well as um, possible for um, Oman fingers crossed and I hope people enjoy the activities and moving on to number three, uh, no better way than to celebrate port uh, world tourism than uh, changing the way uh, to travel and anticipation of World uh, Tourism Day. This is a perfect opportunity to take a closer look on how travel and tourism in uh, industry impacts the planet positively and negatively uh, with uh, locals as um been working on its mission to reshape the world of uh, travel since uh, 2013 by offering authentic um, experiences that connect um, with people and cultures which is very exciting and different and um, number four um, on world tourism day at ch TA reflects on the future of Caribbean tourism so I hope that event goes as well as possible and number five the Minister of Tourism Joseph um, Josephine Connolly represents at the C2TOS destination media briefings so a good luck to um, her on that and uh, number six, Expo uh, City Dubai launches a DH120 one day pass. That uh, that's exciting news for D uh, Dubai, and hopefully it saves people money. Um, 
and uh, number seven at uh, KICC Nairobi to host World Travel Awards Africa and Indian Ocean at uh, Gala Ceremony 2022. Now, um, Number eight, Ibis Styles is uh, bringing a new artistic pop to its uh, Metroverse. So good luck to Ibis on that. And number two, Radisson Hotel Group achieves uh, record growth um, year in Greece. So uh, well done to Radisson for that. And Greece, last but not least, WTTC member and at G2O ministers gather in Bali as a part of the tourism uh, ministerial meeting. Um, I hope um, everybody um, has a good day and um, has enjoyed it. And thank you and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.